Y'all hear that thunder and lightning? Cause I hear it. A whole bunch of turbulence. A whole bunch of turbulence. Everybody strap your seatbelts. Cause it's about to be some turbulence. Well, ladies and gentlemen, let's get into this. No, we're not playing as Marlton. Nope. That's a already a fast underscore restart. There's no way you're making me play as Marlton. Chat, I'm one bone. Do you think I can get the ray gun from the Olympia? Bro, honestly, I think I can get the ray gun. I'm gonna buy the Olympia until I get the ray gun. Because I reset my stats on plutonium. Low key, I think I can get it. Ah, uh, boo. No ray gun. Boo. So wait, how do you get the ray gun perma perk if you don't get it on the first try? Do you just keep having to buy ammo for it? Spam it. It takes a while. Sheesh, bro. Is it even worth it at this point? Oh! Yes, it is. Okay, chat. Are you buying COD Modern Warfare 3 because of Zombie yeah, Ghost dude. Operator Bundle? I saw people on Twitter going crazy over that, and here I am just... I am stone cold, bro. I don't think I have any points in the bank either, because I reset my stats. I think it resets your bank as well, which is a little bit... A little bit caca. Spider-Man 2 clears? No, I think Spider-Man 2 is getting game of the year. I agree with that, actually. 100%. Okay, we're dipping. Round 10, gamers. Round 10 on round 10. Who is this guy? You gonna play Spider-Man? Absolutely, my brethren. I'm gonna be playing Spider-Man. Power's up. Let's get that big man out the cage. Leroy! This man is gonna bring me to... Oh, bro. Do I even have time to open this up? Oh my goodness, very bad idea. Very bad idea. I'm gonna leave a little earlier this time. I think I'm gonna leave at like round eight. I'm gonna leave at round eight. One of my closest friends of seven years is getting married tomorrow. Any tips for calming my nerves? Hey, let's go, W. Chat, I just watched a video. They said that exercise has better calming effects than marijuana THC. Chat, I always say this. I say this. This is a quote of mine. Male therapy is going to the gym. Every time I'm pissed off or anxious or upset, I go and lift some weights. I go for a run. And every time though, I feel way better. I feel so much better. Like, I don't know about y'all chat. I've tried everything. Like the breathing, the mental exercise. None of it does it for me. It has to be that I literally work myself off to an actual sweat until I'm literally dead. Here's a good thing that helped me, right? What is something that like motivates you? Something that motivates me is when I'm listening to like some orchestral music. Or like some crazy good motivational speech. Bro, that sets my heart on fire. That's me when I listen to punk. Bro, but like everybody has their thing that like sets their heart on fire. I've realized that. It's not the same for everybody. I'm literally... I'm dead fam! Oh my gosh, I'm so bad. But no, my, my advice for you to be quite honest is literally... Okay. Boys, what should my first four perks be? Honestly, I should probably get speedy, speed cola, and stamina up. Yeah, I'm gonna get speed cola stamina up here. QR jug, vulture. Oh yeah, I need vulture actually. That's a good point. Low key, actually, no, I'm gonna get mule kick and vulture aid. I actually need mule kick. Oh, oh no. Why do I have to reload? No, bro. I'm not resetting. No, I'm gonna reset. I should not on round 11, bro. Have you ever worked a blue collar job? Like just like a regular job? I did McDonald's before I became a YouTuber. Literally. Bro, every time you come back from working at McDonald's, you just smell like a, a grease fryer, bro. You just smell so bad. You literally smell like you, you dipped yourself into an oil vat. Imagine how we smell at gas stations. Okay, controversial opinion. Gasoline doesn't smell that bad, but I know it's so bad for you. I love the smell of gasoline too, but it's so bad for you. It's literally like actual cancer. 
Like, it's carcinogenic. It is literally cancerous. L take? Bro, I don't know, man. Is there any, like, smells like that that you guys like? Here's the other thing, though. I like the smell of gasoline, but I cannot st stand the smell of cigarettes. Bro, cigarettes, like, they have that, like, just icky smell, bro. Why does BL3 die eyes? Boys, you guys want me to show you the Buddha room? We finished the Buddha room. It looks so good. Look at this, man. It looks so good. Zella did such a good job on the Buddha room, bro. Like, it just looks so good. And so, by the way, the way the PAP camel works is if it's red, that's the Blast Furnace camel. The M1911s that you saw earlier, this camel is actually the fireworks camel. And yeah, as you can see, this is the last tower that we have to do. Once this tower is done, chat, we're going to have people allowed to play test and stuff. It's going to be sick, man. I know people are sick of me, like, trying to explain it or, like, publicize it. But I'm just like, bro, y'all don't even know. Y'all don't even know the half of what we're doing on this map. Like, the map is just going to be next level. If I don't get Paralyzer, I'm effed. Time Bomb! Actually, I'm going to pick that up. I'm going to get all the points here and then just hit the box. And if I don't get what I need, I will just rewind the time. Yeah, you know what? I'm just going to grab this. Let's throw this down. Let's do it. I feel like Die Rise was really close to having a neat cycle story like Shang or Mob. <laughs> Brotherin? On the first go? I was like, bro, I'm going to throw this time bomb down because it's going to be so difficult for me to get it. Little do I know. Chat, okay, what's worse? Overwatch 2 or Call of Duty Vanguard? Oh, man. That's actually a really good question. I don't know. Low-key, chat, I say this. Call of Duty Vanguard might be the worst game I've ever purchased in my whole entire life. Like, not just worst Call of Duty game, worst video game. I don't think there's one thing that is even somewhat redeemable to me about Call of Duty Vanguard. Like, chat, can can we name something good that Call of Duty Vanguard did? Like, actually, one good thing. Shino Numa doesn't even count. Shino Numa is literally not even from Vanguard, bro. Milo Sadface, low-key, I think you're right. That's the only acceptable answer. Like, it is literally the biggest excuse of a video game i think i've ever had the displeasure of playing in my whole life like the fact that my chat also right now is struggling to come up with one good thing that call of duty vanguard did is really bad like okay with a game like bo4 i can name you a bunch of good things that bo4 did some really solid maps some really integrated and fun easter eggs and bo4's multiplayer really fun blackout fun like i can name you a lot of good things about bo4 i can't name you one good thing about call of duty vanguard i hated the perk system i hated the boss zombies like it's all bad Damn Team 5. There we go. Chat, we found it. The one good thing about Call of Duty Vanguard is the music team because Treyarch's music team never fails. We actually found it. Finally. I totally forgot the one good thing. <laughs> the one good thing. Have you ever experienced anything evil? Chat, so the other day, I did experience something. I... Had a very scary dream. I don't know what this was, but it freaked me out. I had a dream that I was in a prison cell. And I remember I was in the prison cell. And on the other two sides, there are these like two... It, I can't even really describe it. They look like dinosaur lizard humans. But like horrifying. And sometimes I wonder, like, Matt, was I placed into, like, a cell in hell or something? But, dude, I can't even describe it. Like, okay, chat. One in the chat, have you seen Doja Cat's, like, demon look? It was kind of like that. But, like, instead of, like, a human face, it was, like, this big dinosaur head that looked like a lizard. And I remember these two demons or whatever they were. They were just, like, walking, pacing around the outside of my cell. It, I don't think I was in hell, but maybe I was. I don't remember it being hot. And then I just woke up 
And I remember being really scared because like the, my dream like zoomed in on like the facial features of these beings, these demons or whatever. And I remember just being horrified at that. I wish I could remember my dreams. Bro, y'all ever like you, you wanted like tell your family member or a friend about your dream. And then right when you're about to say it, you forget it. Oh my gosh, it's the most annoying. I've had that happen to me like a billion times. Literally right when you're about to say it, you forget it. Bro, that is, how does that work? That's one of my least favorite things about a dream. Especially because like, man, you could be put into a dream where you're just the man. You're like, you're having a great time. You're doing great. You got everything you want. And then you wake up. Like, chat, I think I had a dream once that I was playing, like, I think I was playing, like, a good zombies game or something. <laughs> Do we give up on the impossible, EE? -E? I would say. I'm gonna be honest, chat. Blundell has definitely forgotten about the impossible Easter egg at this point. Oh, brother. How did I know I was gonna down there? Oh, no. Bro, I hate when you take, um... A down like that. Jug is getting purchased. Did I lose the paralyzer? <gasps> oh no! Oh bro. I have to hit box. You know what? Let's just hoard and hit box. Let's hoard and hit box. I'm gonna get rid of the Mustangs. I absolutely do not need them. I literally I cannot believe I'm so dead. Oh my god. Gosh, sheesh. I shot Leroy. I don't care. I'm going to, I'm going to honestly, I'm going to go for, um, no, are you freaking joking? Oh no, this is bad. I actually might die. Oh no, dude. I also did not realize my paralyzer was my mule kick. That is horrendous. Okay, no more, no more deaths. There goes QR, F and chat. Okay, let me just get him hoarded up here. Oh! If I get the paralyzer, I'm gonna be the happiest one. I have 100,000 points to hit for it. I should be able to get it quick. Yeah, I'm just gonna cycle, I'm gonna cycle. Not the 5-7, my G. Thank God the box is never going to swap, though. <laughs> the SMR on round 66. Nah, G. Chat, I need immolation. Anybody got a fire sale? Oh! Give it to me! Oh, my. Bro, fine. Okay, that was actually not that long. I'm going to run straight to PAP. Um, because if I let the zombies spawn in, I'm probably gonna die. Yeah, I'm, I don't care how many witches spawn because I run out here. I literally need to do this to pat this thing in time. How many witches are coming? We like 900 billion. Oh! Ah! Oh. Yo, huge perk. Huge perk. W perk. W perk. Salmon up huge. W. We lost two QRs there. That means I cannot down until I cannot down. <laughs> I am not going to go into the witch's hut until I down. Yeah. That's round. Wow. I died right at the end of the round too. That's sadness. I feel like it's close to end of round. Yeah, it's definitely end of round here. Wait, hold on. How many zombies are left? Oh, it's definitely not end of round. Uh-oh. You can never tell I'm buried, man. It is so difficult to tell on this map when the end of round is because all I can see is through this little crack. Like, and the spawns are so variable on, on buried too. It's so difficult. Did you thank the bus driver every single day, bro? I'd be thanking Ted every single day. Ah! We're ready. Leroy, it's time to make a max ammo. How's uni been for you? I've graduated uni like two years ago, brother. Uh, so, I mean, it's been pretty good. <laughs> where is the key? Lads, where's the other key spawn? In the parts building here? Really? No way. On the top floor or the bottom floor? Oh, no. It's in here. Yeah, I forgot about this spot. Come on out, brother. We need you out here. 
Leroy, come on out, brother. I'm going to need you right here. Please just give me the max ammo so I can just end this round. You criminal. You literal criminal. Max ammo. Max ammo. That's that's just not a max ammo. It's just not a max ammo, my guy. No, he's gonna block me if I go. Oh my gosh. Could you imagine getting sandwiched by the zombie and Leroy? Stop! Oh my gosh. This this is the dumbest animation from Leroy. Oh, it's stinky. Oh, did I step in it? Oh, stinky. Shut up, bro. Okay, you gave me a double points. You gave me a carpenter. Max ammo. Finally. The anxiety I feel each time Lex goes to get a new turbine. Bro, you feeling it? What about me? Literally, as soon as the round changes, I'm off to the witch's hut. I'm not even gonna grab a turbine. I am off. Oh! Yo, we did it! Oh, I'm grabbing a turbine and we're heading to the witch's hut immediately. Screw the time bomb. I'm better. Not double tap. Anything, please, just not double tap. Don't give me double tap. Please. Please. What did I do to deserve? <gasps> we're living, we're laughing, and we're loving, boys. That's a fat W right there. I'm still lasered in, bro. These are the last 20 rounds. This is when things go bad. Every time I play this, this is, the last 20 rounds are when things go bad. We're set. Boys, how much longer do you think this is going to take? Five and a half hours? I'm saying, bro, I'm saying two hours minimum for these last 15 rounds. Bro, two hours minimum. No! What are the chances? No! Oh my gosh. No, I can do one more. What are the chances of that happening? No! Leroy! No! Let's take it and just delete them, sir. Yeah. There we go. Where did he even go? <laughs> Look at him. What the frick? He's just running in, bro. So, bro, get out of here. What are you doing, G? Mule kick in A94 would be a good investment. The thing is, though, is that what happens if I down? Here's the other thing. I'm not even guaranteed mule kick because I could get double tapped by going into the witch's house. But I'm going to be honest. I don't think I'm going to go into the witch's house un un unless I down. Chat, it was looking real grim earlier in the 70s. But honestly, the comeback was beautiful. The way we were able to pull this run together was really beautiful. I think this is 90 right here, though. Are we 90? Are we at 90? There it is! 90 is here! W- 10 more rounds! 10 more rounds! Yeah, these rounds, the 90 rounds are gonna take so freaking long, boys. Like, okay, we started round 90, I think at six and a half hours. So, I mean, yeah, we literally might not get to 100 till like seven and a half, eight hours in. Yeah, these last 10 rounds are going to be exceedingly long. 94, 94, 94. Let's go, W94, baby. Two rounds away from my PV, boys. Two. If anything, we get a zombie speedrunner house. That would be sick. A bunch of speedrunners grouping together. Bro, I was thinking of even doing that where, like, getting a bunch of high rounders to, like, spend maybe, like, two weeks in a house even. Or, like, a month. And just hitting all the fastest high round records possible. Could you imagine... If you had like five of the best high round players in the world, you would literally get all the highest rounds possible. I think we're coming to the end of 95 here. Yep, the zombie spawns are getting slow. There it is! The PB round! Four more rounds. Four more rounds. I wonder how many turbines it's taking on these late 90 rounds, bro. Every round, it's probably like, honestly, it's probably like 10 to 20 turbines. Is what I'd guess. 10 to 20. 98! Come on! I need subway surf subway surfer gameplay. Shut up. Bro, if you are that attention deficit, like just deleted, I don't know what to tell you, man. That's rough. 
There it is, baby! One more round! One more round! Come on, come on. We're close, I can taste it! Ah! Oh! Oh! God is watching me! Oh my gosh! Oh my gosh! <laughs> oh, they're running now. They're running now. They're running now. Bro, stop! Is this it? No? Bro, stop! Stop, man! We're getting so close. Chop, we did it. We did it! We did it! Yo, we did it! Let's go! Bro, that's it! There it is, ladies and gentlemen. Round 100. Buried. 8 hour 28. We did it! Let's go, man! GG! After so long, we finally get it oh my gosh chat i'm following what everybody said we're slowly we're slowly hopping down down the well we go oh oh i'm so dead nope <laughs> eight hours and a half ggs boys that was it dang we finally did it